a self-admitted child rapist and murderer, was served up a dose of his own medicine by a group of furious inmates after he was left in the general prison population. 25-year-old Brazilian jiu-jitsu instructor Daryl Dixon Meneses Xavier turned himself in to authorities following the death of his stepson, Miguel Starr, a one-year and eight-month-old toddler. Xavier admitted to raping and killing the child despite being despite initially claiming the baby had been dropped and started having seizures. After Xavier was in custody, prison officials decided to let the other prisoners met out their own form of justice in the most vicious way possible. According to reports, as many as 20 prisoners raped and tortured Xavier before he was tended to by medical staff. However, he was returned to general population where he was administered another dose of prison justice with inmates tearing out his fresh stitches and brutalizing him some more. A grisly image is making the internet rounds of Xavier following the savage attacks. Let's just say that the prison authorities did not offer Xavier a change of pants for the photo. Before you decide whether or not Xavier not only deserved the prison justice he received, but should be further humiliated and tortured, Remember that he raped an innocent little child, not yet two years old, and beat him so badly that he succumbed to his injuries two days later. It is rare to hear of a monster such as a child rapist and killer receiving the exact same treatment he afflicted upon the poor child. But when it does happen, there seems to be an overwhelming wave of support from most people. Yet we as a society, at least in the United States, do not condone such behavior in our laws or amongst most of our elected representatives and cultural influencers. Were very many people upset when Jeffrey Dahmer, child rapist, murderer, and cannibal, was beaten to death with a metal bar in 1994 in prison by inmate Christopher Scarver? No. Will anyone, or at least more than a handful of people, be upset by Xavier's treatment at the hands of the other prison inmates? highly unlikely. Why should years in prison with the possibility of getting out someday be the ultimate punishment for child rapists and murderers? Are we as a people better than physical torture and punishment, i.e. that type of behavior is from the dark ages? Or does the seemingly blanket desire for bloodlust mean the majority of us are okay with the type of punishment inflicted on Xavier, and therefore the will of the people should be done?